Hello, are we rolling? Hello everyone, it's me, Mrs. Kantsman. How are you, Chag Sameach? Happy Hanukkah! In honor of the Festival of Lights, which is happening now, I am making a traditional Jewish Hanukkah food, which is called potato latkes. What are latkes? Potato pancakes. Have you ever wondered if your second floor deck might suddenly collapse and wake you from a deep slumber one morning? This video isn't about that, but I have. Hello! Hello everyone and welcome back to Winks with Cynthia Tidley, the YouTube channel for people with a quirky sense of humor. If that's you, please click the subscribe button as well as the little gray bell next to it. If that's not you, send this along to someone who cares. This week we speak once again with Mrs. Katzman who is celebrating Hanukkah. Welcome back Mrs. Katzman. It's time for your dose of fun. Know why they're called latkes? They just are, and what they really are are potato pancakes. Come on over. I took four rather large potatoes and risked life and limb, and not really, but I did almost scrape part of my thumb. But don't worry, Mrs. Katzman's fine. Anyway, I took them, I grated them, and here they are. Just a bunch of potato gratations. Gratations! That's like a, a special potato boy band, the potato gratations. I've concocted a little bit of mix of eggs, onion, pepper, baking powder, salt, garlic, and mixed them all up. I'm going to take some of this potato mixture and just dump it over here, gently, okay? Because you don't want to do it all at once. So you can take a scooper, you can take your hand. I prefer really getting to know my food. I think it makes the food taste better that way. When your food knows that you are right there with it, it makes all the difference in the world, I believe. Okay, so then you do a little bit of folding gently, and then you grab and go. It's kind of like, Fast food, uh, but not a grab and go, okay? And you just do it like this. And I'm gonna do the rest of this, and then uh, we'll see you in just a moment, okay? All right, everyone, so we're gonna take a little scooper. This I'm not gonna use with my hands because there's egg in there, and I don't wanna get salmonella poisoning right before the Hanukkah festivities. So we're using a scoop instead, and we're gonna put it into this pan, which is already heated with oil. Oil is very important. Well, our temple was destroyed, the second temple in Jerusalem. And it was thought that there was only one night's worth of oil to light the eternal flame. And it turns out that a great miracle happened. And Neskadol HaYashon. The oil lasted a full eight days rather than the one that they anticipated. And the moral of that story is don't try to destroy other people's temples. Anything fried, and you know my affinity for donuts already, but I thought we should go with a little traditional route this year. If you are in a pinch, you can run out to KFC and still be celebrating the Hanukkah. I'm gonna pat them down a little bit. It makes them feel good about themselves. Good job. Everyone sometimes needs a little pat on the back. And then we're gonna cook them for about five minutes. And then I'm gonna flip them. It's been about five minutes. And I know it's been about five minutes because the underside is nice and crispy and brown and firm and we're gonna flip them now, okay? And here it is on top. Flip and make sure that the oil does not splash you in the face. We're gonna leave these on here for another three, four minutes maybe and uh, just stay tuned. All right, I'm taking them out now. You can see the underbellies. Uh, I'll let you see them over here. Any, any recipe worth its salt will tell you to lay down some paper towel before you take them out. And why? Oh God. 
<laughs> flying sauces. I love them. Because there's oil, okay? And as much as we love oil on Hanukkah, uh, our body science has shown we don't love it in excess. Have a happy Hanukkah and uh, a wonderful holiday season. And if you have any questions, you put them in the comments below. All right, take care now. Mm-hmm. <laughs>